So hi guys, in this video I'll be telling you how to install TWRP for MI11X and Redmi K40 the Poco F3 so the prerequisites are you need a locked bootloader and you should be on MIUI or any ROMs based on NOSP and support TWRP so you need to go to additional settings now and go into your developer options and make sure your USB debugging is enabled and once your USB debugging is enabled connect your phone to your PC with the original cable provided by Xiaomi and then reboot your phone into fastboot by powering off your phone and keep on pressing volume down and power button until your phone is booted into fastboot and once your phone says fastboot uh, that means your phone is in fastboot mode this is just a different ROM so the fastboot mode is different so now in your PC all you need to do is go to the V3.5812 and download the TWRP image for Redmi K40 which works for the POCO F3 as well as the Mi 11X so now once your image is downloaded you can go into your platform tools folder and open CMD there by typing CMD to check if your phone is directed in fastboot mode type fastboot devices and well my phone is directed in fastboot devices now let's start the flashing process of the TWRP by typing fastboot boot and drag and drop the recovery file Now click on enter. Okay, fine. The spelling is wrong. Fast boot, boot, and again drag and drop the image. Now it says sending boot. Wait for your recovery to get flashed. And if it says finish total time 4.812 seconds or anything else, your phone that means your phone is gonna boot into fast boot. I mean your recovery. So let's wait for it to happen. So as you can see the TWRP is booted and the version has changed. To make the TWRP permanent you can either copy your TWRP image to your folder which I will be doing now. And once your image is copied you can go into advanced install recovery ram disk and select your TWRP image you just copied and swipe to install so if your phone was rooted previously that means your phone has been unrooted and the boot image has been replaced and I think you can install root from here as you can see install magisk and magisk alpha so you can install the direct latest version which is the magisk v25 if you wanna install root you can just swipe to confirm it will just install magisk v25 So once the installation is done, you can go to home, reboot and select recovery to check if your recovery is flashed completely. So if your TWRP is booted, that means your TWRP is completely flashed and is permanent. And your root is also successful if you want to install root. And this is how on this video is on how to install TWRP. And if this video helped you, please like, share and subscribe. Bye.